Hello, uh, today I'm going to talk about how to create um, a feature line and edit edit that feature line. Um, for example, um, you want to draw a feature line, you want to start with a polyline, make sure you draw your polyline array. Um, and um, also make sure you you want to cancel the snap tool so you can you don't snap the control lines and then you click it so you draw lines down here just um also um please, please make sure the um, the points of your drawing the polyline points is um it, it's appro appropriate you don't want too much points you don't want it too little points okay and then um, you select the lines and then go to feature line create feature line from objects and then you can choose a site um, in this case we can make us just name the site one but um, just remember this line is site one okay um, and also you want to check assign elevations and click OK and uh, uh, make sure you don't choose in intersect intermediate grade breakpoints okay it's okay don't do that um, and uh, from service we want to check existing rhino contours so when we click hit OK um, you know, see this line is almost, you know, just follow the topo, okay? And then you can, once you have this feature line, make sure you, uh, you hit the elevation editor. So, you know, uh, every points and also every points have this uh, triangle symbol that highlight for you. So, you know, the rotation of those points. So, um, at this point, what I need to want to do is, um, I want to increase the elevation of all those lines. So you just make sure the elevation, uh, you can set up the interval. Uh, I can, let's make it 0 0.5. And I click here. So every point just increase 0 0.5. Okay. And, and when we do that, and you can see here, uh, this line just raised a little bit. Okay. Uh, they become higher. Okay. Uh, we could do that again. Um, just select this line and go up, go up, go up, go up. So, so you just keep going and it become a little bit higher. See here, it become a little bit higher. Um, so this was this, and then then the other important thing is, what if I want the, this line? So what if I want this line from, um, let's say from this point to this point here to here, is two percent. Right. What if I want to do that? Um, then you want to use this set elevation by reference tool. You click it. Then you click these points, and you click this point, which is the points you want to change. And then we want to show that they will show up the grade, the distance, the elevation. Okay. And then you click OK. You can set up grade. Let's make this grade two percent. So right now it's two percent. Okay. Um, and also, if you hit the quick elevation edit, you will they will you will see what's the grade of between each point. Okay, so this negative one, so it's not universal. Uh, you can if you go to observe, so you will see here. There's it's not a smooth. There's we didn't see any smooth transition from it. Okay. So, but this point to this point is two percent for sure. Okay. Um, and then what we're gonna do is we know here to here two percent. Then we gonna use this set grade slope between points. You click that. You click this point first. They want to specify elevation. You click enter, and then you just hover over on this side, and you click these points again. And you will notice all these points are have double triangles, which means those points are selected. Okay, and if specify grade, they will have a default grade for you, which is um, automatically calculated for you. Okay, if it doesn't change the grade of these two points. Okay, if we hit enter, and then right now, if we look at the grade, it's all gonna be one point six, and if we look at the Object viewer, see here. So it's there's a smooth line. There's a smooth transition. 
to here. The smooth transition between here and here on this line. So all, all here is really smooth. Okay. And then the same. So then we want to figure out on this side, which is click here, click specify elevation, and then just hover over on the lower end, lower side, and then click here, and specify grade is 1.35, which is what we want to do. Okay. I uh, hit enter again, and you hit the pre elevation tool, and you can find all the grade is the same. And then when you look at the observer, you will see here this line is super smooth. So every point between every point is the same elevation, same grade, okay? And it's 2%. So if you look at this way, so from here to here, it's 2%. And all the side down here is super smooth. So that's what we want. Okay, that's the tolerance. That's the uh, gradient structure we want to create. Okay, just remember the tools. Please um, figure out the tools. One is quick elevation edit, just for looking at the grade and elevation of all those points. And the other is set grade slope between points, which is just make set up make two points. Um, set up the elevation and grade between two points and make all the points uh, in between the same grade okay all the point points in between the same grade and the set elevation by reference is just any two points they can set up grades for you okay so basically that's what we're gonna do cool so uh, just make sure you can understand this and you understand the um, you know, feature line, edit, elevation tools. Okay, all those tools. You should be really familiar with those. Okay, so that's this for today. I'll see you next time.